Hello, in this video I am going to show you how to create a Cupertino switch. So a switch is just something that you can turn on or off like a light switch. Cupertino switch is just one that's stored in you know, an iOS style theme. So to implement it's really simple. So I was going to add a child. He's going to put Cupertino switch. Uh, we need to earn the value and unchain does that. So the value is I'll put something in there. the value I'm gonna to set to false by default. So you see the true or false, true being it's switched on, false being it's switched off. On change, I'm going to put this method that just points out and there's a low error. Oh yep, sorry, we take in the actual value. So I'm just gonna print out the value. So let me Save that which will hot reload it and there we go we got the switch so as you can see I clicked on it but it didn't do anything but it is still coming up in here let me see if I drag it I can drag it like so but it is still coming up as true so what we need to do is use a set state and before that we want to create a variable so it's going to create bool we're going to say switch state equals false and instead of setting it to a, a literal value we're going to do switch state and in here when we do set state and if we say if I say switch state equals value and what this will do is simply refresh all of this because this has been updated and set state says reload this and that's hot reloaded if I click it as you can see switches on switches off but it says false as well and we can swipe it accordingly and that's really it for the Cupertino switch you can change the active color apart from that there really isn't much no more to it if you have any questions though feel free to pop me a message actually what I want you to do as an instant task is add you know it's a text widget that just describes what this is you could do it at the top or to the left if you have any questions, like I said, if, you know, feel free to pop me a message. And as usual, I look forward to seeing you in the next video.